In this video, we will look at using VMware Workstation Virtual Machines in Fusion. This video is based on VMware Knowledge Base Article 1002320. Fusion and Workstation Virtual Machines are interchangeable. There is no need to use VMware vCenter Converter when moving a virtual machine between Workstation and Fusion or vice versa. The virtual disk formats are the same and the virtual machines can be used in either program. When moving a virtual machine between Fusion and Workstation or vice versa, you must remember these points. Workstation virtual machines keep their files in folders, whereas Fusion virtual machines keep their files in a virtual machine bundle. Fusion can use the folders created by Workstation without issue and Workstation will see the Fusion bundles as folders. To convert a Workstation Virtual Machine folder on your Mac to a bundle, just add .vmwarevm to the Virtual Machine folder's name. Workstation has some features that Fusion does not. Fusion will either show a warning but still work, or simply ignore the feature, depending on the feature. Fusion supports snapshot trees, like Workstation, but the Fusion 3.x and earlier interface does not display the trees. Instead, it simply shows a list of snapshots. Fusion does not support Teams and will ignore them. Fusion does not run on Macs that have parallel ports or serial ports. If a virtual machine that has a parallel port or serial port connected is powered on in Fusion, Fusion presents a warning that the connected device does not exist. The virtual machine continues to power on when the warning is dismissed. Fusion does not necessarily support all guest operating systems that Workstation does, and vice versa. Linux virtual machines may be optimised for the processor on which they were created. All Macs use Intel processors, but your workstation host may have an AMD processor. If this is the case, see VMware Knowledge Base Article 1011788 for more information. This concludes our look at using VMware Workstation Virtual Machines in Fusion. For additional tutorial videos, be sure to subscribe to our KBTV YouTube channel and our KBTV blog. Thank you for choosing VMware.